Supreme Court, but for the reason that uh, you must be aware, and the millions and millions of uh, large Shivari devotees got affected with the canards spread by the Chief Minister, present Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, that uh, the ghee that's being used in preparation of laddu is adulterated with animal fat, which is totally untrue. And uh, it was never supplied. This AR Foods, the successful bidder, never supplied the ghee during the YSRCP regime. It was supplied in your regime. And uh, as per you, you said that, uh, as per the report, it was said that they have supplied 10 tanks. And six were accepted and four were rejected. So rejecting means you have a testing facility. That means that you should have a testing facility. And the EU has gone to the extent of saying that we don't have a testing facility. It is totally uh, not in consonance with the fact of returning the trucks. If you return the trucks, means that you have tested it. So originally TTD would conduct three tests by three persons. If that is okay, then that will be accepted and uh, brought inside the campus. Then only that product is used in the preparation of London. If it is rejected, it will be sent back. There is no chance of it getting mixed up or being a part of the laddu preparation. But though that is the situation, uh, they have spread the canards and the falsehoods. Second issue, they say that it is mixed with animal fat. The ghee that is supplied to me, he got around 390 rupees a kilo. If he really wants to mix animal fat, that costs him 450 to 1200 rupees. Could you expect somebody to mix a higher priced item in the adulteration? For example, I could put water in your milk, milk that is supplied to you, but am I right? I cannot uh, put milk in the water that is supplied to you. If I make a copper vessel, I, I say that it's copper. Don't, I, would you expect me to mix gold in it and sell it to you, give it to you? If I say gold vessel, then I could mix copper in that. When I get 319 rupees per cage, could you expect me to mix it with four, about 1400 rupees worth of product? Nonsensical. Yeah. So I pray, I once again, I want to infuse the confidence in the millions and millions of bhaktas that it was not the case. Whatever that was found up not to the standard was rejected. Nothing was, uh, whatever, uh, if uh, admittedly for argument's sake, whatever it's adulterated, never reached the stage of being a part of making laddus. This only my prayer. We request the Honorable Court to constitute a committee Expert committee with food technology, with by being headed by retired Supreme Court judge. That's all.